I'm a big fan of compression bags. I use them whenever I travel for my, for my uh, clothing that I go in my bag. And I opened up one of my cupboards and I had this big pile of pillows and blankets and it was just overflowing out of the cabinet. So we got these big compression bags and I'm really excited to be able to show you how much stuff you can fit inside these things. These things are massive. They have a pretty little picture of a crane on there as well. But the nice thing is they have kind of a flat bottom to it and you can stuff them full of so much stuff. And then once you have them full, you close it up, stick your vacuum on here, it sucks all the air out of it. So this huge pile should pack down really small. Let's go through and show you how it works. Grandma's heirloom here. So you can see how full this bag is here. Nice thing, these bags come with these nice little clips. And what those do is they help you close the bag. So it has the it has a double zip closure here. Give it just a little squeeze. Follow that along it. You could always get some of the air out if you wanted to ahead of time. But that's what your vacuum cleaner's for. So you go through, I always like to go twice over just to make sure that it's closed. And then the clip will stay on there. Okay. So all that stuff is in here. It has the little vacuum valve here that will stick the vacuum on. This bag here has an open and close. We wanna make sure that we're twisting the valve to be able to open it so that it's ready for suction. So we'll go through, stick our vacuum right on there and watch the bag shrink. So we took this bag that was this full of stuff, packed it down, the valve has a little open and close, so once you're done vacuuming it, go ahead and close it down just to make sure that it's keeping it sealed. The crane is now a baby crane. It went from a big full-size crane to a little baby crane in this pack. Look at how just nicely compact this is. Now certainly this is something that if you wanted it to be a better shape, you could kind of mold it as you're compacting it or, or as the vacuum is sucking it down. Once it sucks into a layer, you can sit there and mold it a little bit so that it holds a, a different shape. But uh, I'm not worried about the shape. I just want to be able to pack this in so that it will fit into my cabinet and this thing will fit so much nicer now. Look at that. Oh, I love compression bags. I know you will too.